Good morning. Welcome to the vlog. We're vlogging again. It's, I know, I know it's been quite some time, but sometimes life happens and there's been some stuff going on. And now we're back to vlogging. So, hi. Happy to be back. I'm a little tired right now. It's pretty early. We are on a road trip. So what we're doing is we are driving to Montana actually from LA to see Cody's parents. He hasn't seen his parents in a long time and so we are finally going to get to go see them in Montana. And we thought let's make a little road trip <clears throat> out of it. Do you want to tell them where we're driving right now? Vegas. We're going to stop in Vegas and get some good food and then we're going to go from Vegas to Salt Lake City. Utah and stay the night there and then wake up and drive up to Montana go through Idaho which I'm excited about um, because I've never been there and I've heard they got great potatoes um, Idaho, you don't. <laughs> there's traffic so Cody's super excited we I left an it. hour later than we were supposed to we have some traffic to sit in and I am gonna sleep or cry I'm, or both. I'm not really sure. I do have this double shot energy Starbucks drink sitting here, so that's pretty exciting. Maybe I'll be a little hopped up. I ate shit earlier. I wasn't laughing at you falling because that actually was really not fun to watch. You like, <laughs> you, like tripped on a shoe and like just ate shit into the chair. Her, I saw her arm like bend around the chair. I thought you broke your arm for sure. I thought I did too, honestly. I just think it's funny how many things you were carrying. I'm always carrying things. Kelsey goes, all right, I'm packed. I'm packed. And then she picks up 90 things outside of the bag. I'm like, you could have just put those in the bag. She just likes carrying things. No, like, no, no. I just, having loose things everywhere. I just have my bags organized in like a certain way. Like, I've <laughs> So what's that part? Four hours until Vegas. And I'll check in at the next hour, just like we did when we drove to Tahoe. And if you have a good brunch spot in Vegas, let us know. Yeah, when you're watching this two weeks after we <laughs> are, have already done it. That's from when I fell. You know, out here in the desert, you really don't know what's real and what's a mirage. 59 <clears throat> minutes! Woo! <clears throat> uh, excuse me, I'm so sorry. It's like the whole time he doesn't burp, and the minute I turn the camera on, he they're, starts burping. They're hunger burps. Herps. They're herps. <laughs> I, got, I got the herps. Yeah, we're listening to the Apology Line. It's a one-tree podcast. A one-tree. It's pretty good so far. It's about this anonymous line that people, that this guy made for people to call in and give apologies for like crimes that they've committed. 56 minutes, we'll see you when we are in the cracked egg. The crack den. We'll see you when we're in the crack den. <laughs> Some jalapeno bacon, nice and crispy. And then I got a 
croissant sandwich with scrambled eggs and like hash browns. That obviously. looks really. This is kind of scary. And Cody got what is the this? Monte Cristo. So it's a sandwich, and then they deep and you fry it. Dip it in maple syrup. They put it in. They put it in French toast batter. Is it good? Is it good? That's fucking crazy. Wait, can I try it? Mm-hmm. Oh my god. Yeah, good, right? Oh my god. It tastes like a... Like a funnel cake, but... Yes. I think I have to get one. <laughs> Let me show you guys a little update. First of all, look at me vlogging in public. There's also no one outside. <laughs> These hash browns are fucking amazing. The cracked egg is the shit, isn't it? Yeah. I rate it a 10 out of 10. What do you rate it? 8 out of 10. You heard it here first. Okay, we are back in the car. Something very exciting was across the street from the cracked egg, and that is Dutch Bros. Which might not be exciting to anyone else, but I've heard about Dutch Bros for so long, and I've never tried it because it's not there's not one near us. And so this was fate. I got an annihilator with oat milk. I'm ready to be annihilated. I did already take a little sip. What's so funny? You said I'm ready to be annihilated? <laughs> yeah. Dutch Bros, you guys need new branding, honestly. No, this is so fucking what good. What the fuck is that logo? Dutch Bros, 10 out of 10. I'm giving everything 10s out of 10s. I'm a pretty easy judge today. Arizona we just crossed over the state line and we are stuck in a bit of a traffic jam it's like a 35 minute delay in this when we were leaving jam Vegas here. it was like we were driving and it was open road driving down the road and the GPS time was just going up by, by one minute like every minute it was going up it's like my nightmare. I was like, what is coming? Because then you know there's some impending yeah. awful situation, you know? Yeah. You're like, what? What? You know, I hope everybody's okay because it's been an accident, it seems like. I'm feeling a little sleepy. That Dutch, Dutch Bros tasted good, but it did not give me any sort of caffeine. We've been on the road since seven. <laughs> It's been seven and a half yeah. hours. We're still five, six hours away. If you can't tell, we are not moving. We haven't fucking moved. We're just sitting here on the highway, just sitting in our car, and it's like boiling fucking hot. We are literally just, look, we're just sitting. Look at it, my car's in park. Cody's car's in park. We are this desperate to be entertained. We're watching, we're actually watching this way. <laughs> Reality show. <laughs> Can we just enjoy this? No! I refuse to enjoy it! We're moving again! Yay! Honestly, now I'm just. Now I kind of wish we were still parked watching the Sway show. I know, now I'm very into the Sway show, the Sway boys. Um, so. That's that. We're Sway stands. We're st swans. We're swans. <laughs> Kelsey, please give us your gas station routine. Yeah. So I'll finally do that. Hi. Okay, so we are back from the gas station. The gas station. The gas station. This isn't my usual like gas station order. I don't really have one. It's like whatever I'm feeling in that moment, I feel like you you can never be too sure exactly what you want. Today we have for you. Cheeto puffs, call me absolutely crazy. Salt and vinegar Pringles for little sweets. Peanut butter and chocolate Muddy Buddies. We're driving through Utah now, trying to make it to Salt, Salt Lake City. We have four hours and six minutes. Four minutes. Salt Lake City. Salt Lake City, what's, what's up? Salt Lake City. 
Hey! We're so close, you guys. We are so close. We're four minutes from the hotel. Salt Lake, the home of the Salt Lake City. We made it. Um, my camera died as I was explaining to you guys that the podcast about the anonymous like apology line was just okay. We did listen to the whole thing, but it was just okay. But the one we're listening to now, in your own backyard, and it's really, really good, very interesting. It's our view of the city and the US Bank. And we're just here for a night, right, Chili? He's excited. <laughs> Day two, the second and final day of our road trip. We went to dinner. It was like this like cool like bar kind of restaurant thing. I don't know. It's called Whiskey Use. It's called Whiskey something. Yeah, I wasn't gonna say the name because I wasn't gonna say and <laughs> Fuck it, call them out. I think the hotel last night sucked ass. The Kimpton and Salt Lake City. And listen, I fucking it's, love it's Kimptons. The... I love Kimptons. It's like my favorite hotel chain ever. You guys boofed it on the Salt Lake City one, all right? Place sucks. So we went to Whiskey Stews, Whiskey Street, and I wanna, first of all, I wanna throw up thinking about it. It it was a great vibe. Great vibe, great drink menu. The drink I had was fucking delicious. It really was. I just don't think my body was like ready for the food that we got, and we got a weird mix of food. We got fried pickles, we got deviled eggs, and we got meatloaf. <laughs> Which mean, like weird well, order, for people sure. People are probably like, well, there's your First, third, second. The meatloaf was mistake. really, really good. The deviled eggs were okay and the fried pickles were okay. My body just couldn't handle those foods and so we got home and Cody went to sleep and I was like, I had the worst pain in my stomach. I thought I was gonna throw up or, you know, have it come out of another, another area. It was just bad. It was just bad. Um, and now I still kind of feel like shit. I was given 10 out of 10s like it was my fucking job yesterday. I would rate Salt Lake Experience 5 out of 10. Can I, can I vent another thing? So we like, to, we're walking chill, we're walking back from the restaurant last night and we're like, we should take Chili to go to the bathroom, but he really doesn't like the bathroom area in front of the hotel. So I was like, fuck it, we'll just do, I'll just do it in the morning. Sure enough, he woke up at 4.30, 4.30. 4.30 in the morning. So anyways, he wakes up at 4.30 and then he goes outside and pees and I was like, all right, that's probably all he's got. <laughs> and so I went back inside and I asked the guy in the lobby for some water and he gave me a couple of water bottles. And then as I'm like, thank you, and pulling away, Chili pulls up and just takes the fattest deuce on the hotel lobby floor. Maybe he didn't like the Kimpton either. Maybe that was his way of telling us, never bring me here again. <laughs> Maybe. And I dropped both water bottles and I like unscrew the thing and like the poop bags were a brand new roll so it was like a little, it was taped. So I had to like pick the little fucking tape thing off and take the, pick up the poop as fast as I could. What's up dude? So we're gonna drive through Idaho um, but like none of the like actual like big cool cities in Idaho. So I don't really know where we're gonna stop or what we're gonna do. We're just gonna get on the road and we'll make it to Montana at some point. And that's that. Nine and a half hours, that's it. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Look at the beautiful view from this gas station in Idaho. All right, let's go. I really cannot get over all of these like shots that I'm trying to get of like the beautiful scenery that reminds me. <laughs> and they all look so bad. It's just 50% bugs. It's just 50,000% bird shit that dried on your car. And bugs. Bug guts. These are little bugs that explode. No, they're not. Yes, babe. To be honest with you guys, Cody is crushing this drive. I'm just kind of sitting here. I slept for a little bit, but I really appreciate it. And I offer, I've been offering. Mm -hmm. He's, he wants to do it. We have about like four hours and 45 minutes left in our drive, probably. 
which we're kind of crashing. Yeah, I know. One lone boat cruising through the water. One lone boat cruising through the water. Thank you guys so much. A little sneak peek at our album. We stopped at the nearest local food store. Oh, yeah. We went to McDonald's. <laughs> so I got a cheeseburger with added, and I added mac sauce. But I can't really look at it or else then I won't eat it. I usually only eat this when I'm drunk and I like don't care so much about like what I'm eating. I thought this vlog needed a little mukbang. Those are my favorite videos to watch. Snack Queen on TikTok. I was just telling Cody about her. I think she's my favorite TikToker. She just eats everything and she makes it look so good and she's not worried about like I get so like I get like grossed out by like meat and I get so worried that I'm gonna get food poisoning. But she just eats everything and she's del she just enjoys it. Look what I've done. There's so much fucking sauce on my shirt. Hello. We are cutting, getting closer. Look at this beautiful lake we're driving past. Holy shit. It really is so beautiful. Those are all trees on that, on that mountain. We have 55 minutes left. We're very 55 excited. 55 minutes till we hit whitefish, but then we gotta drive up the mountain. Well, yes, but I mean, that's, yeah, it's not that bad. Once we're, we're there, it'll there. be. We're in Whitefish. Chili excited for Whitefish. We're here. Now we're just gonna drive up the mountain and we'll be at Cody's parents' place. Woo! Sorry. How are you feeling? Good, I'm rejuvenated now. Whitefish Marathon and the Half Marathon. Where? Oh. Cody. Oh no. He's not rejuvenated anymore. I have to run 10 miles on Sunday. That's oh God. He's running a half marathon. I obviously am not, but I, that will be in another vlog. Isn't this little town awesome, you guys? Whitefish is so cool. Okay, you guys, we are just about here. Um, so this is gonna be the end of our road trip vlog. We're almost here, so I wanna say bye now, and then there'll be a Montana vlog. So get ready for that, and I hope you enjoyed this. And thanks for road tripping with us, you guys. We love you guys, and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.